All right, here's the prototype. Did this once already, but the focus was bad, so I'm doing it again. Just want you to see everything real well. Let's see. So there's the uh, radio and batteries underneath it. You don't need a battery this big. You really only need something that's like would fit in that inside that outline. You can use double A's if you want, or this is a lithium polymer battery, but see that long thing? That's the antenna. Uh, right there is an, the oscillator, basically which uh, sends the pulses out to the receiver once, you know, the trip is trapped, or trap is tripped. Right there is the uh, the trip on the uh, the siren, and you can see how there's that clip there too. Man, the focus on this camera is just terrible. Here we go. Nice. All right, that's a lot better. All right, so yeah, there's the radio. There's the oscillator, and that's like the terminal and the clip. You can see the clip there. That's like also like the, you know, what what sets the. Uh, siren off so it's all set up to go right now except there's no cheese and then here's the receiver <clears throat> this is all on a breadboard so uh, doesn't necessarily need to be you know it just it allows me to just not have to solder these things like when I'm testing them and everything but you can see there's really not a lot to it uh, that's a 5 volt regulator right there right there 5 volt you really don't need that either. If you have a 5 volt battery, you can just plug the 5 volt battery right in. And then this is like the receiver, and then you can see the antenna. And then there's like the, the speaker right there. There's the speaker driver, that little uh, circuit. You see that little integrated circuit. And then there's the LEDs. You can kind of hear it. I'll put the microphone up to it. You can kind of hear it just, it clicks like when it's on. And I mean, I could get rid of that if you wanted to, but like I think it's kind of cool to like let, it lets you know that it's working, right? Uh, and it's really not that loud at all. It's just kind of, you know, kind of neat. So let's trip it and see if it works. It should. Let me focus again. I know this thing might just fly up into the air. I haven't even done this yet. So yeah, you can hear it now. See how the lights are going off? And you can hear that buzzing noise. And we can change the tone of the buzzing if you want, but I think it's like actually pretty good, like where it's at, like it's real nice and like piercing. So that's the speaker it's coming out of. Yep. And then like when you reset it, you just take and you just take this cable tie here and you slide it into you slide it into here. I mean we don't have to do it exactly like this, but uh I thought it was kinda nifty the way that I did it like this so and then the whole thing comes off whoa yeah if you touch it it'll make a different noise too which is kind of funny let's see uh, I can't do this with one hand hang on There we go. Alright, so I took it off. So you can see... Yeah. See the clip on the end? Wow, the battery... I had the battery glued to the bottom. I'm going to cable tie that back on. But when you want to put it on, you just hit the clip and just slide it, slide it on there. So yeah, that's that.